like your hair. You don't like my hair? No. Why? Why don't you like my hair? He doesn't like my hair. Is it really that bad? I see you. I still see you. Good morning everybody. It is Wednesday morning and we're just getting in the car. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning and uh, we are headed to the hospital. Today we are going to get a DEXA scan and labs. I have no idea what a DEXA scan is. I guess it measures the bone density but it's a different kind of bone density ordeal. He doesn't want to be on camera today. Anyway, we will see you at the hospital. So guys, I wanted to show you this. I drew it out on a piece of wood and then my husband cut it out and then um, we painted it with gold glitter. And so at night times we have lights around it. We stapled lights to the back at night times. Um, it's really pretty at night with the gold. I, I think they're more like yellow lights, but they look gold against the gold paint. My phone. That's <laughs> my phone. That's <laughs> my phone. You can't have it. You can't have it. Okay, this way. exposure is going to be equivalent to about a third of a regular x-ray because it's low level. Okay. This beam is only strong enough to shoot from the bottom, get picked up by a receiver. This is not an x-ray per se. I'm not taking an x-ray of the hip. I'm using a low level x-ray to scan his bones. Okay. What I'm scanning for is a thing called his bone mineral content. Right. That our bones are made up of different minerals. The predominant mineral is calcium. So for all intent purposes, I'm measuring how much calcium is in his bones. Okay. So it uses that low level ray and it slowly moves up the body and it's measuring the bone mineral content. Now why did they tell me not to give him his vitamins? Because some minerals are time released, some release better than others. Um, if the calcium is in the pill and it's not dissolved, so calcium gets absorbed through your small bowel. Right. Gets digested by the stomach, goes to small bowel. If it's not fully digested and it's sitting right here, it's in the area I'm scanning. Okay. My machine do doesn't know the difference between his, bon his bones and that calcium pill. We'll measure both of them. Okay. So we'll falsely elevate his results. Okay. Okay. Head down, legs up. That's awesome. What is it? I don't know. What do you say? Reason, yeah. You're welcome. The reason I didn't know we had one was our nurses just brought one back and filled it up. He's a dragon. Spyro, lead us. Lead the way. Does Spyro know where we're going? No. Yeah, because Elijah is so loved at this hospital, somebody gave him Disney Infinity characters from the Child Life Services with the Skylanders case. Howdy folks, we are done for the day. Elijah had his DEXA scan, he had labs, labs look good still, um, and then we saw the doctor, and the doctor um, said that he looks good. Next week, we do two days of 
infusion chemo and not the pills that he's been taking. So we'll be staying overnight on a Wednesday and Thursday. So there's not much to update as far as this week goes. Next week we start the the new medicine called the Bevacizumab. Um, this cycle he had this thing called um, Zometa. Zometa, however you want to say it. Um, next week we start the Bevacizumab and um, that's the one I'm concerned about. So please keep praying about this uh, new medicine that's going to be injected into him next, starting next week. He's only going to have one um, injection of it, um, one or two, I can't remember what they said, and um, maybe that's the reason why we're staying the night next week for chemo, I'm not sure. So anyway, um, that's the update for now. Next week's going to be a little bit of nerve-wracking um, week uh, because they, uh, supposedly this bevacizumab causes nausea and vomiting, um, and he's already taken chemo, so two of those. Hopefully he won't get sick. Uh, you know, hopefully he won't be having any side effects like he hasn't been already. So, um, the DEXO scan, as far as I saw, but you can't really tell. Um, it takes two days for results to come back. So we won't get results for another two days. And of course, I'll, I'll say something on his Facebook page. Um, but from what I saw, I didn't really see much. And when they did the MRI last week, there wasn't any bone density issue. So I'm hoping that there really isn't much of a bone density issue. Um, it's just within a week. But, you know, it's between an MRI and an x-ray. It's totally different. They can read further in depth with an x-ray. Anyway, um, if you haven't yet, please subscribe to Elijah's YouTube channel. Also, down below, I'll leave the links for his Facebook page. Um, please take the time and comment on the YouTube channel videos. Um, also, thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs up if you like him not having any side effects. Um, and we will uh, see you later. Ciao. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Mm-hmm.